Time's up. Look, I appreciate what you're going through, but you can't keep barging in like this. Yeah, try stopping me. Michelle, I nearly lost a contract because of you earlier. Oh, it's always business with you, isn't it? I never really saw it till today. So, I guess things must be pretty difficult round here at the moment. Well, let me think. You know, we're in the middle of a recession, the profits are down, my business partner's a self-confessed murderer. So, yeah, things could be easier. Mm, so why not quit then? You did it before. That were different. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah, you wanted a, uh, a fresh start. It was more complicated than that, and you know it. Really? Really? Well, more complicated than when our Paul died? Or the so-called love of your life being murdered? Funny that, isn't it? It's funny. How the words fresh start never really entered your career mind then, but a little matrimonial disharmony. I don't have to listen to this. Why the police question you, Carla? Hey, you think you're involved, don't you? You think that's why you went to the States? Let go of me! What, so you couldn't run away again? Whatever you think, I loved Liam with all of my heart. Then tell me the truth. He died because of you. One way or another, you're to blame. Being scared. Is not a crime. Oh, my God. I didn't have a choice, Michelle. Is out once and for all. Let her go. Mum! She's not worth it. We stood together and we shed the same tears, Carl. We shed the same tears. And then you just be on his grave. really happened and maybe it was as you say that doesn't change the fact the first face my nephew saw was his father's murderer that's what you've got to live with I was scared 